Hey, my name is Becky. Um, today I'm just going to show you what I keep in my makeup bag. For base, I used Bare Minerals um, in light, fairly light, and it already has um, SPF 15 sunscreen in it, which is really good. It protects your skin. Um, it's a little expensive, but if you are willing to spend the money, it's worth it. Um, I've had this for a couple months, and I'm still using it. Um, so yeah. To apply it, I use this um, baby bookie that I got from Bare Minerals. Um, the whole package was like $40, and they resend it to you, but you can tell them not, not to send it to you again. Um, so for like around my eye, I get I have red eyes like around my eyes, so I use this brush that came with it um, to fix little problem spots. It's that's what the commercial says. Uh, for blush. I use CoverGirl. I got I get it from Walmart for five dollars. I used uh, five, I use five ten, which is uh, iced plum. Uh, it comes with a brush. It's a nice light pink, nothing too extreme. I like that it has a mirror with it because I wear glasses, obviously. So when I'm in the car, I can't see the mirror when I'm applying my makeup, and I use this. For eyeshadow, I um, just got this uh, new Maybelline uh, Expert Wear in 50, which is Sunlit Bronze. I like it because it has four different colors for four different areas in your eye, which we'll get into in another episode. But this was $5, um, but I think it's worth it. I used to use um, this, which is from CoverGirl. It's 750, which is mink. Um, if you haven't noticed, I really like natural looks. You know, nothing too purple and orange and all sorts of crazy colors. But yeah, um, earth tones. That's what I use the most. This was, I think, four dollars. But I've had it for a long time, and I've only used like half of it. I also sometimes use this um, liquid eye shadow. It's from Avon. Um, I got it from my grandma. Yes, I said my grandmother. She didn't use it, so she just gave it to me for free. So, if you have people that don't wear a lot of makeup, sometimes they'll buy it and just never use it. So, sometimes they'll give them give you stuff for free. To apply my eyeshadows, um, they come with brushes, my eyeshadows, but I don't really like them. So I use these two brushes. I got them together for two fifty at CVS. Um. And they're from the company Essence of Beauty, which I think is a CVS brand, but it doesn't matter, I guess. Um, I use this thicker brush for applying big areas and blending. It's great. Uh, this one came with it. It's at an angle. And I use this one for smaller details and, like, harsh lines, which I don't really like, but sometimes I'll do that. Mascara. I use CoverGirl Professional in black. Uh, if you like more natural looks, um, you could go for brown black. Or if you like to stand out and like be extreme, you could get the like the very black or extreme black or something. This was five or six dollars. I use waterproof because my eyes water a lot, so I use waterproof usually. But sometimes I use um, regular mascara that's not product waterproof. And when I do, I use Rimmel Lash Max. Uh, the brush with this is great. And I get I got this one in extreme black. And sometimes, if I'm in the mood for it, I'll wear this. But I really like the brush on this one. That was about the same price, $6. Every time I use mascara, which is pretty much all the time, I um, comb my lashes after I apply it with a... Uh, um, eyelash brush and uh, this one I got from Maybelline it was four dollars but it's hard plastic so hopefully it'll last a while excuse me uh, for a lip gloss I use uh, I just got this one it's covergirl wet slicks roots spritzers 
Um, I love the smell of guava, so I got the guava splash flavor. And just like any other lip gloss, you know. Oh, I love that smell. <laughs> um, and sometimes I'll use this, and other times I'll use this one, which I also got for free. I don't know where, but I've had it for a long time, and it lasts a while. So, I use this one too. Makeup remover. I use, um, I have sensitive skin, so I use Clinique Take the Day Off, um, because it's fragrance free and, you know, all sorts of stuff, whatever. And this is a little more expensive. Oh, yeah, I forgot to go over the prices. Please. This is for $4, I think. This one was like $8, 8 or $9, I think. Um, but I've had it for a long time. It lasts a while. And I have half left. I had more, but I spilled it down the drain by accident. So I use that when I take everything off. But I love this. It's like my favorite thing in my bag. It's, um... A makeup eraser pen. If you make a little mistake, you just take it and just like erase it basically. And you just wipe your where you marked it with a tissue and looks like it was never there. And this is like six dollars, but it's completely worth it. If you want to buy something new, get this. It's incredible. It's from Revlon makeup eraser pen. So yep, yeah, that's pretty much what I use every day. Um, you know, just average stuff. If you have any questions, comments, suggestions for a new show, um, give me a, send me a message or an email. If, uh, yeah, pretty much, pretty soon we'll be getting into more techniques and stuff, but I just wanted to show you the basics, what I use every day. Um, okay, see you later.